I want to get up out of my chair, throw like, the chair over my head, smash the monitor, <laughs> take your take your shirt, rip it off, whip it around your head, smack your butt. That's what I want. It has been a lot of days since we watched the last episode of My Hero Academia. What's My Hero Academia again? You know, Nezuko has to turn back into- Yes, yeah. that's right! And no, then Goku solos. My Hero Academia has been a pillar of this channel and we love the show so much. I think this show has definitely got one of the most dedicated fan bases too. It's just a very exciting experience to watch a new My Hero Academia episode every time when you know there's a big fight coming up or mm -hmm. something big. Building. And that's exactly what's happening here it's as we're huge. getting towards season six. Today we have a trailer for season six. It's not very long, but I figure we take today to just kind of break everything down and talk about what we're looking forward to, maybe some theories. If you guys want to watch the reaction to season six, episode one, when it airs, it goes over on our Patreon first and then it'll be over here on the channel. So make sure you're subscribed. Well, let's hop into it, see what the trailer's got. Let's and do get it. Get a little taste of MHA again. <laughs> oh man. It's crazy that we're working together now in the midst of society. This season's gonna be an all out. Oh, that's a detective you think is a spy. I've always said like sus things about that I know. detective for what an if, all my Like, what if you're right this whole I, I time? I think we're at this point ready to throw that out. I don't think- It's a fun theory. <laughs> <That's> a <laughs> nice. Annihilation of heroes. Oh. <laughs> oh, he looks cool like that. It's like in that Goku uh, dynamic chamber, just getting ready to pop out yes, and 10 times know. stronger. Look how cool he looks. Are these subtitles right? Maybe not. I'm just watching the animation. Oh, wow. <gasps> Bakugo! Yes, Midnight. Dang, girl. The music here is so good. So we got a lot of fighting. Oh, what's her name? Mir Mirko? She's cool. Mirko? I forget, but she's cool. Was that Mount Lady in uh, yes. Gigantomachia? Yes, it was. She's cool. Is this the new opening? Whoa. That's one thing I want to talk a lot about is her. I'm excited for her and Dobby. Dobby. Can't overlook that. <gasps> Oh! She's dripping! Look at all that. That was all of that guy. What's his name? Twice. Twice. Toga looks crazy, as usual. The vestiges. That Shigaraki. You know when they meet face to face, it's gonna be insane. That smile. Here and now, color surpasses everything. What do you mean by that? Who knows if these subtitles are even right? Obviously more than anything. The relationship between, what, her? She's that, kinda nice. That <laughs> frame, yeah. <laughs> she, okay, that's what I was gonna get to in a minute. But before I say that, the relationship between Dobby and Endeavor, whatever our theories are we've had on that before, I feel like sh should stick true. Family relationship, you know, that missing son Toya. That's your theory, No, Boo -Boo. that's that not even, it's not even a theory. That's just what it is. No, that's it. That's ain't, just straight up the that truth. That ain't my theory, that's yours. Who else could that be? That's your theory. I'm just trying to see what the relationship's gonna be like between them. Because obviously if things had gone so south to the point in which Dobby ended up like how he is today, he's got a big vendetta out against daddy -o, yes. and there's gonna be some yes. big moments of conflict with all the family members. Second thing, Mirko. This like super girl buff bunny hero. She buff. <laughs> I can't remember like... what she was ranked. Do you remember what number she was ranked in the hero Ten. ranking? I just made that up. She's always fascinated me and I think that this is gonna be the season that she has some standout moments. It looks like there's some fighting frames that she's obviously a part of here. Yeah, she's going up against some villain there. Dobby shows up. Yes. I'm sorry, but Dobby is not Toya. There is a hundred percent it. Obviously one fight that we are kind of confirming is twice and Hawks. Hawks, Hawks is winning. It looks like Hawks is like jabbing all of his wings through twice. I honestly, my favorite League of Villain characters have to come down to Dobby, Twice, and Toga. The only other thing that was on my mind initially, I mean, just look at Shigaraki there for one. He looks great. Red. The white. The eyes. Crisp eyes and hair. It looks crazy. He is going to be the embodiment of everything that All for One was. Going up against the new generation so All Might within Deku. Uh-huh. I mean, we're just seeing history repeat itself and see if we can get a different outcome now. One other detail I really liked is seeing Mount Lady and Gigantomachia <laughs> have like a wrestling match. Yeah, that's going to be dope. That's a good frame. The last thing to mention, the vestiges. Do we think he's going to get more power or more control of power from other owners this season? 
Yes, All of the vestiges. That I, that's a cool shot. Three more in the back we have not met yet. The other three we've had a little bit of contact with or we know about. From the look of it all, it's going to be very familiar with just getting back to the storyline, but there's so many cool new elements. Jeez, I, mean, I can't imagine how many new powers or abilities they're going to have too as the season progresses. It's going to be wild. What I'm hoping that we do have happen is a little bit of intensity in the regards of life or death situations. I want to see some people's True. lives be put on the line. For sure. I don't know if that's like twisted of me to say. A little. A little bit, okay. but it's like, I love the show, but one thing I really want to see them add upon is I've stakes. I'm not just talking stakes like little baby stakes, little baby cows, innocent civilians. I'm talking heroes or villains on the verge of life or death. Tight-knit situations. Agree. That's what I've wanted from the beginning. That's why I think I like season five because we actually started to get that. The pressure felt more intense. If there's anything I do know is that Shigaraki's not gonna have mercy on anybody. Any of these UA kids step up in front of them, we're gonna lose a character. Yes. That's what I want out of the Same. season. It's for my jaw to drop during our reactions. Yes, That's me too. I'm after. I want to get up out of my chair, throw like, the chair over out. my head, smash the monitor, <laughs> take your take your shirt. Rip it off, whip it around your head, smack your butt. That's what I want. Theories. You go first. What do you got for season six? Uh, How do you feel like it's gonna end? Deku's what do you think will be? gonna get all the power. He's gonna save the whole world. So you're telling me like the normal storyline? Yeah, the normal storyline. He's gonna no. save the whole world. That's what it has to be. And All Might's gonna die and see Deku like on his last that, You just breath. so casually threw that in there. And then, I'm gonna go ahead and say that we will lose an important character this season. And I don't think it's gonna be a Deku, Bakugo, Todoroki all night. But I do see a potential for a My Villain Academia cast or one of the UA students to tragically go out at the hands of the League of Villains, the Liberation Army. Just because I know that this is a common theme within this show, people want to be shocked. Because I hear that the, the manga is shocking. And, I, and when people say that to me, the only things I can really think Think about that'd be too shocking to me of a concept within this show. Mm -hmm. Somebody being taken out of the universe in time. Right. The only other thing that could really be super shocking to me is if like we just lose. Not if anybody dies, we just lose to Shigaraki and he exactly. takes over society. That might be a shocking point of turn. The power that this man has probably just obtained. Nobody goes into the Goku chamber Namek pod and doesn't come out a billion times stronger. That's just how it's gonna work. He got injected with that good juice. I mean, the trailer looks good. The song for it sounds even better. The day that Deku and Shigi are face to face, fist to face, is gonna be a good day. October 1st is when yes. the first episode airs. We will be reacting to it early first over on my Patreon. So go check that down below if you want to watch it before YouTube sees it. And then it will be out over here. So make sure you are subscribed as well so you don't miss the reaction. It's going to be a good ride. We are excited for that and so many other anime this season. So, so let great. us know what you're liking if you're excited for season six of MHA and what else you want to see on the channel. If you enjoy this video, go ahead and drop a, a sub like. like that subscribe, a like, and a comment. comment. We'll see you guys in the next reaction video.